I just did a past life reading where she existed as an alien during ancient Egypt. This is now the second person I've connected to during the same era where the aliens walked the same time as humans in ancient Egypt. She was specifically a Pleiadian alien. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. Doesn't fucking matter. She came from Pleiades to help. And part of her job was to build electric viewpoints is what Spirit kept telling me. So she existed in 14 BC. These are my crazy notes that I scribbled. In 14 BC, she existed. So this wasn't like what we know as textbook ancient Egypt when the pyramids were built. She was there when they built another source before those pyramids. But what what her spirit told me was it was a focal point in the same region where you can build on the land to connect to the stars and the source. So part of her job as a Pleiadian alien down on Earth in ancient Egypt in 14 BC was to connect those. Connect Earth to the stars. Another really big lesson that her soul just taught me in this is that humans who existed at the same time as well still knew hate, jealousy, control, and anger. And that was a big part of the humans not liking existing with aliens at the same time. They thought they couldn't reach this power level that these aliens had, that these other species had. I also saw visions of um, a lioness woman walking around. So it was half lion, or it was human, female up top lioness on the bottom so there were hybrid animal humans they were humans aliens all existing at the same time it was crazy but also really beautiful to see at the same time to know that we all existed there and there's a hope that we will all exist like that again on earth but that's where we come from that's what we're used to but there was this trend of like humans not liking that humans not feeling capable humans not knowing how to tune into their power and so the aliens would try to help the humans by connecting earth to sky so aliens are like hey you can't do what we do obviously we're 17 feet tall we have different abilities but you can connect to source just like us and that's why they helped create these pyramids these energetic electric viewpoints that they kept telling me about so her soul was trying to remind her now in this present lifetime that she has the ability to connect to that again and the way to do that is co to connect herself to earth more connect herself to animals, the food she eats more, into her body. Connecting to earth connects you to source, God, spirit, the sky much easier. And it can't all be done through meditation. It has to be done through daily practice of connecting yourself to the land that you're on. If you're drawn to a certain place, go visit there. If you want to meditate in an area that feels like it resonates with your soul more than your home, go do it there. There's a reason and you can connect better to different things for that reason. She also told me that the half hybrid animals and the cat species, so like tigers and lions, would help them find the electric viewpoints to help them build the pyramids.